Hello everyone, welcome to Wack, uh, Wack, oh fucking, welcome to Wack Comics. I'm here with Tyler. Hey. Tyler here. We're going to do fucking origami time. You read it right. It's on the screen. It's origami time. Oh, I'm so ready. Folding paper. I, it, I love it. It's my favorite. Yeah. I love origami too. It's, it's yeah. such a good time. I've never done it, but it is super fun. I've, I've only done it a few times, but uh, I can't remember doing it, but I remember not doing it sort of thing. I was yes, there. exactly. That's how but, I feel. Yeah, so I've got this uh, Iron Fist uh, comic book. I felt like Iron Fist uh, would be a good character to to do some origami with. What do you bring to the table? What oh, that's got? great. So I have these uh, origami squares made from comic book paper. So you got them. You got them cut out already. Yeah, mine's fully prepared. Really you're me. you're almost prepared. So it's like the same thing. Shit. All right, so. You tell me I need to cut it into squares to start off with. Yeah, that's what I would do. Or you can just rip them, or or you can just do rectangles. I mean, I don't think there's any rules in origami. Okay. All right. Well, maybe I can't confirm the... that. Okay. Well, I might just for this first one, if I can, just try and we'll start with the cover. Oh, that came out perfect. That's perfect yeah. for origami. It is comic books are the, it's like the staples of just made to be easily you know, ripped away at. But, yeah. So we've, we've got our first, first page. I'm going to try and, I'm going to try and bring this Iron Fist to life a little bit more. He's like, just, sort of just like a little bit two dimensional on the piece of paper. But I think with the art of origami, we can make him a bit more three dimensional and, and bring him into this world a bit more. Oh, that'll be so cool. I bet no one ever uses uh, comic books or covers of comic books for this. It's such a great idea. It is. Yeah. Uh, let's let's get into it. I okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start folding. Okay, I so it was it's perfect. They can watch you, and then they can see me do it, and then they can uh, see both of our results. But yours will be in real time, right. while mine while mine is almost kind of like a secret until the end, which is kind of fun. Because I'm secret I'm not. Uh, <laughs> this isn't like a good origami secret. Oh, this yeah. is gonna be so good. I had an origami secret from the 10th grade that I still haven't told anyone. That's commitment. Yeah. No one's fucking getting that origami secret. I'm going to take it to the grave, too. Oh, I like that. I like how you're... I'm doing, I'm doing a little different strategy. I'm, I don't know my end result yet, but I do know what I'm going to try after this first effort. Okay. When you're doing origami, the main thing you want to make sure when you every fold you do, you want to make sure you really get your finger down and give it a nice push, you know, so that the paper knows there's a fold there now. Yeah, if it's That's, not flat, it's not going to work for this origami. And we're not we're not trying to be amateurs out here with our origami. No, no, this takes years of practice. Yeah, I mean, I I don't really do it, but it does take years. It really yeah. does. I like how this is coming together now. Yeah. I don't think I'm very good at this, but I I feel like I could be. <laughs> yeah. Well, I gave if I gave it a couple tries, I think after this first try, I think I might have it. But this this one's not turning out real good. Well, I'm I'm sorry you feel that way, Tyler, because I feel quite the opposite. I think mine's really coming. Oh together. my goodness! This is. Uh, I need to step up. Yeah, this is uh, the the perfect origami piece. Uh, you know, so I, I don't know why more people don't use comic books, you know, for origami. Because look at that. You've got on one side, you've got all those folded pieces that you you would normally get on an origami piece. And on this side, you've got an uh, iron fist with his, you know, fist in his iron, giving it a good time. Man, I'm so jealous. That's my first one. I'm going to try and just put that up there for now. I'm trying to will. get. I feel like mine's coming together a little bit. I got yeah. one or two more folds, and this might be just about perfect. Mm. I can't wait for the grand reveal. This origami secret is killing me. Okay, so it's kind of like it's kind of like a frog. Ooh. You can see, there's the mouth right there. Then he's got 
these two little legs right here. I see that. I see that. I feel like it's not good, but it is my first try. So give me some more tries that I think I might have this. You can kind of rib it a little bit. That's not too bad. Well, that is a good ribbit. It is. That okay. Is okay. Ribbit. I have, but I have a bunch of paper. So this attempt number two. All right. Attempt number two. Let's do it. I think you can crinkle the paper. That's like the one thing I didn't do there. It it's folds and crinkles. So I might try to use the crinkle to my advantage, but you don't want to over crinkle or it's not really origami. You just have to use it sparingly. I saw yeah. that on a TV show once. I, I, I swear I, I don't get the same network uh, in Australia as you do in, in America because I've I haven't been fortunate enough to see that. The only origami techniques I've learned are from the streets. Yeah, we do have a lot more origami shows. There's no doubt. Yeah, uh, there was one time in the park when I was six years old. You know, we're just down there folding paper, and yeah, yeah. This there was this one one mate that I knew that would come down with his football in one hand and a stack of paper in the other, and we would, you know, would kick the football out and would say, "Fuck this, let's fold some paper, origami time." And he he's the one that really gave me the the this and the that of origami. I don't have many friends that did origami with me, but the ones yeah. I did are, aren't my friends anymore. Oh, no. No. It's hard to hold on to origami friends. They do other things. It is. It is. I've got to say, I don't, you know, those friends that I had when I was a kid, like, they're not the same friends that I, you know, it's this, this not the same hood that I kick around, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's, uh, uh, I, I still hope they're doing well, and I still hope that hope that every now and then they pull out the, the old origami and get to folding because you know it really is just a peaceful experience. Yes, it is. Oh, this one, this one's turning out for me. There's this is a step up. Ooh. Ooh, excited to see your, your your next piece. I've got. I think this next one will really fly. So if you look, it's kind of like almost like a dragon. Oh my gosh. It's got a little tail on the back. It's not the best tail, but see that? Nice. Look at that. Oh, wow. It's kind of awesome. I'm like getting that. good at this. I wouldn't yeah. say I'm great yet, but I'm getting there. That's really cool. I like that you did a dragon because I also did something that, you know, goes in the sky normally. You got a, a really cool plane out of this one. Oh, it's like Check. almost like a paper airplane, but more origami. Yes. You can tell it's definitely more origami from the wingspan, yep. you know, and uh, uh, the folds. You can tell these aren't these aren't paper airplane folds. These are origami time folds. Yeah, it's a lot different. It just takes uh, more practice and a little more uh, push on the paper, you know. Oh, I have a, I have one for sure. I can do. You got another one? Yeah. Oh, for okay. sure. Okay. All right. This one. This one's an easy one. I think. I just have it in my head, and I. Can bang it out real quick. Well, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna pull out one last page and, and try and do yeah, one with you quickly go. as well. Okay, this one that was an easy one. It's kind of oh, like a it? fish. <laughs> you got to that one too quickly. That, can you tell? I, like that. I don't think I, you can really tell. No, is it's kind of like a fish. Oh, oh, even the eye, it kind of looks like it has an eye right there. It sort of looks like Nemo's dad mm. a little bit. From Finding Nemo. I don't know if you've okay. seen that. That's an Australian movie. I'm not too sure if you've seen that movie. Finding yeah, yeah. I, I've heard of it, but honestly, I we don't get many movies like that over here. Oh, uh, true. Well, you gotta, you've got you got to check it out. It's an it's a Australian idea. indie, really. You know, Indie film? You know, yeah. There's not too many uh, Australian old. indie movies. But I got a couple more. Oh, this one's going to be good, too. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's not, I don't think that's too bad. Okay. I mean, I, it's not, it's not my best effort, but it's kind of like a, like a butterfly. Oh, I see the butterfly. Yeah. It's kind of like, there's his wings. You can kind of see it. It's like flying. I don't yeah. think that's too bad. I'm getting better. Yeah. I need to do some more like comic book related ones though. I just did a, a little table for your butterfly to sit at. I don't know if you can see that, but it's a little table. Oh yeah, that's good. Yeah. It's like a, you know, you can have some tea there, uh, some biscuits. Because uh, tea and biscuits is always good for it all the time too. 
Oh yeah. I might just make some some little tea and biscuit um, cups and make a little origami cup even. Okay, so this last one, th this honestly probably my, the last one. I, this my, this okay, I guess. It, it's kind of like a bat. Oh, I see that. It's like Batman. Yeah, like Batman. Bat yeah, like Batman. See how you fold the wings, fold in, and yep. This I remember a little better, but I remember your your Batman fact that you gave on on the live stream the other day. If if you're not if you're not what like haven't got the notification bell on you, you, you need to get on the notification bell because Tyler drops some hard knowledge every time we go live. Um, yeah, gives you gives you three fun comic back facts, and uh, yeah, it's, it's you got you need to you need to join us live. Yeah, it, it's really great. I always give you three facts. Some people might know them, but you might not too. You never know. Yeah, and, and they're, it's just interesting. And they're exclusive for our live videos, though. So if if you want to if you want to find out what, what we're talking about, you're gonna have to get in on a on a live. But have you seen these cups that I'm creating? These origami cups. I've put this is my third one now. These are just like for the tea time. We've got you know oh, got the table. Oh wow. We've got one, two, three cups happening now. I like so everyone, that. Everyone's going to have a nice cup of tea at the origami table. Spot of tea, spot of tea. Spot of tea. And uh, I'm just going to do some cookies now to finish it up. And I, I reckon after these cookies, we'll start wrapping it up because uh, I think I might have to treat myself to this um, origami tea party that, I'm, that I've made here because it, oh, it's making me... Idea. It's making me a bit hungry. It's making me a bit thirsty. I'll Let's have a little some... like animal party over here with the fish and the bat and the bird. Ooh, that sounds like it'll be a good time too. Sounds, sounds like origami time has uh, benefits after origami time is finished. You know, like, yeah. or, it's like origami time never ends really. Yeah, this seems like something I should be doing more like as I read comic books. I really don't know why I don't. Yeah, these are the cookies that I'm doing. See these cookies? Get some some little cookies for the tea party, you know. Oh, that's great! You don't want to eat like a really big cookie, you no. know, like a, a sick stomach. So we just got those little. That's ones. just the right amount, especially yeah. with that tea. Yeah, really is. It kind of looks like a distant bird. Oh my! I don't know. It's not great. Mm. But the thought that's is there. It is the like you, you tried. Yeah, I'm trying. I I'm not sure if it's as good as your tea party, but it's, no. I have an animal party, so it's it's just yeah. different. Yeah, animals are a bit more ruthless with their teas. You know, yeah. they don't know don't know how to look after things. Hopefully, I can come up with more ideas here because I have so much paper. But if I don't, I always have extra for later. Yeah, we can always do another origami time if you want. If you want another origami time. Just let us know down in the comments because, yeah, this is just straight fire. We're coming at you. You know, I've got my origami iron fist. I've got my my tea party going on table, teacups, cookies, my uh, my plane. Tyler's Tyler tried. He yeah, tried I did Tyler. my best. I can't can't take my, that away from you. My butterfly. Here's my bat. Mm. Not too bad. Not, not too, mm, not too bad. My fish. Yeah, like I said, Finding Nemo. I don't mind that one because of Finding Nemo. It's an Australian classic. I've got a soft spot for it. Yeah. You fucking tricked me. Fucking tricked me. 